The continent of Africa has produced and continues to produce countless fine footballers, although many of them have to move to Europe in order to maximise their potential. Nowadays, near all the teams in the top leagues in Europe will have at least one African player in their squad, and some many more than that. Make sure to watch to the end of the video as we go through the top 10 greatest African footballers of all time. Before we start, don't forget to subscribe and press the bell icon to get the latest updates. Number 10. Abedi Pele Widely regarded as one of the best attacking midfielders of his generation, Abedi Pele won the African Cup of Nations with Ghana in 1982, and when they reached the final again a decade later, he was named Player of the Tournament. Named African Player of the Year three times, his biggest successes in club football came with Marseille, with whom he won three successive Ligue 1 titles, as well as the Champions League with them. His three sons, Andre, Jordan and Ibrahim, have all gone on to play international football for Ghana. Number 9. Mwankwo Kanu Kanu was a tall, gifted striker with a penchant for producing unexpected flashes of skill and creativity. That was despite being born with a congenital heart defect that at one stage threatened to derail his career. The Nigerian won three successive Eredivisie titles and the Champions League with Ajax, and then after a brief spell with Inter where he won the UEFA Cup, he moved to Arsenal. During his unforgettable time in North London, he won two Premier League titles and the FA Cup, and was part of the Invincibles team that went through the entire 2003-04 season unbeaten. He then moved to Portsmouth and scored the winning goal for them in the 2008 FA Cup final. All the game that he keeps parrying and blocking things, and that's another simple goal for him here. The Nigerian played in three World Cups and won Olympic gold with his country. Number 8. Essam El Hadari El Hadari is an exception to the rule that African players have to move abroad to gain international recognition. The goalkeeper spent his entire domestic career in Egyptian football, although he's best remembered for the 12 seasons he spent with Cairo club Al Ahly, winning the league eight times with them. Known as the High Dam because it was so hard for opponents to score past him, he won four African Cup of Nations titles with Egypt, three of them in successive tournaments between 2006 and 2010. At the age of 45, he became the oldest man to ever play in a World Cup match when he appeared against Saudi Arabia in Russia in 2018. Number 7. It's Dancing Roger Miller Roger Miller became one of the most famous players in Italia 90 when he helped Cameroon become the first African side to reach the quarter-finals of a World Cup. Four years later, at the age of 42, he scored against Russia, becoming the oldest scorer in World Cup history. Twice African Footballer of the Year and voted AFCON Best Player on two occasions, he played for numerous clubs in his long career, including Bastia, Saint-Étienne and Monaco in France. Number 6. Sadio Mane Mane is one of the best African players to play in the Premier League era. With Liverpool, he's won the Premier League, FA and League Cups, the Champions League and finished on the losing side in that competition twice. He grew up in a remote Senegalese village, but came into European football via Metz before making a name for himself with Red Bull Salzburg. That earned him a move to the Premier League with Southampton before Jurgen Klopp came calling in 2016. The Senegal captain scored the penalty that ended their long wait for AFCON success early in 2022. He was named player of the tournament afterwards. Winner of the Premier League Golden Boot in 2018-19, he was named African Player of the Year at the end of that season. President. Good evening, dear invited guests. I'm really honoured. Number 5. Mohamed Salah Arriving in European football via Basel, his first foray into the Premier League with Chelsea proved to be a flop. He never settled and was sent on a series of loan moves, including to Roma, who then made the switch permanent. It was his form in Italy that persuaded Liverpool that he was worth a second chance in England, and their faith has been rewarded in abundance as Salah has developed into one of the most lethal strikers in world football, with 118 goals in the famous red shirt. A hero not only in his native land, but also in North Africa and the Middle East, Salah is captain of the Egypt national team. Twice African Footballer of the Year, he has three Premier League Golden Boot awards and was voted Player of the Year in 2017-18. This award for me is always, I always say this award for me is very big. I love it because I saw it when I was young. 
Number 4. Yaya Toure Coming from a football family, older brother Colo also had a very successful career with Arsenal, Manchester City and the Ivory Coast national team. Yaya Toure gained the reputation of being one of the finest box-to-box -box midfielders of all time. He led the Ivory Coast to AFCON success in 2015 after many years of near misses and was named African Player of the Year four times. Part of the Barcelona team that won an unprecedented six trophies in 2009, including La Liga and the Champions League, he then moved to Manchester City. During his time at the Etihad, he won three league titles, the FA and League Cup, and was their Player of the Year in the 2013-14 season. Number 3. Didier Drogba Drogba was something of a late developer, and it was only when he joined Chelsea that his career really took off. Under first Jose Mourinho, then a succession of other managers, he became part of the golden generation at Stamford Bridge, alongside the likes of Frank Lampard and John Terry. He won four Premier League titles, four FA Cups and three League Cups, and in the 2012 Champions League final against Bayern, not only did he power in a last-minute equalising header, but he also scored the winning penalty in the subsequent shootout. Twice African Footballer of the Year, he made 105 international appearances for the Ivory Coast and was his country's Player of the Year on three occasions. Number 2. Samuel Eto'o Eto'o retired with his trophy cabinet stuffed full of medals. He won three league titles with Barcelona, one with Inter and also won the Champions League four times with three different clubs scoring in two finals. Winner of the Golden Ball at the 2010 Club World Cup, he's both Cameroon and AFCON's highest scorer of all time. He also won Olympic gold in 2000. At his peak, Eto was regarded as one of the best strikers in the world, feared for his pace, positional sense and accuracy in front of goal. Number 1. George Weah Weah, who is currently president of Liberia, is unique among African footballers in that he is the only man from the continent to have won the Ballon d'Or. The striker had a glittering career in Europe, winning the French Cup with Monaco and then twice with PSG, as well as the Ligue 1 title during his time in Paris. That earned him a move to Milan, where he won two successive Serie A titles. African Player of the Year on three occasions, he was voted African Player of the 20th Century in a respected poll. This was our list of the best African footballers of all time, but of course you may be furious about any names we missed. Well, let us know in the comments below how you would rank the top 10 African footballers of all time, and we'll see you in the next video. Thanks for watching.